ownership is very important because you're in control, you have that sense of security. And yeah. even if you look at a wider, the wider scale, when you are owning your own your own property, even within the neighborhood, the, you get a greater sense of control. I think that's a really strong point you're saying. So by being a homeowner, and then you have that 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 community around you of other homeowners that represent the values you represent or or maybe even look the same you have more leverage then to determine and decide what that community looks like and and how it operates i mean the point that comes to mind for me is you're either your mortgage or you're paying off somebody else's mortgage yeah when you go back to some of the numbers i mentioned at the beginning where you've got you know a thousand percent capital appreciation since the 1980s, we're either benefiting from that and then creating the opportunity to our children, or we've just paid off someone else's mortgage. We've all probably heard the, the phrase, make your money work for you. For me, it's essentially like you going to work every day, waking up in the morning at 9 a.m., sorry, going into work at say 9 a.m., working a 10 to 12 hour day. But at the same time as that, your money is working for you while you're working. So. For me, owning a property is really just a great way for people to, to start their investment journey. But there's no point looking at houses that are, you know, 600, 700 K and what you can afford is way below that. So it's important to one, know your budget and, and what a really quick and easy way to do this is to say, what is your total income of everyone applying and then multiply that by 4.5 is a very easy way to, to do it.